to make it a little bit easier. If you can get rid of some of the archers, that's you'll have an easier time with it. But I don't want to surprise me if that's not the case either. Now, I think the plan is to run out that other side. And actually, I may just drop off and see if... That nah, looks like he's back. That's all right. So my plan is to go run to... Get him to chase after me if you can. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Oh, I got some ashes out of it. Ow. I was blocking that, apparently not. While he's doing that, I'm gonna heal. Also should be a little easier to get back steps on. For some reason I'm having a hard time doing that. Two Titanite Jarts. Cool, that means we can upgrade our Parma. Not to mention give Orbeck. I know that works too. Let's go ahead and heal. I bet you can just get gnarly covenant points with this section alone if people haven't played on our Londo and know what to expect. just popping them out at me. Okay, let's make sure there's nothing going on on her. More arch friends, evidently. See if I can get him to lose interest by breaking the line of sight. Huh. 
see if there's anything cool up there. I don't know, it seems like it would be kind of weird to jump, though. These guys are pretty good. 2500 a pop, too. They're not a bad source of souls. But yeah, I wouldn't mind getting a great bow, because that would make dealing with these guys a little bit easier. I wonder if maybe there's one in Erithiel Dungeon and uh, what's it called? Profane capital. So knight there, archer there. And what about over here? Anything? Oh, hello. You get real good fighting you guys, it looks like. I'm sure you can be doing the same thing over and over again. Let me switch you all day. That's a cool little bad attack. I judge my distance better. Chunks, or rather your shards. Let's make sure there's not anything hanging out over here. And apparently not just a guy waiting to shoot you in the back. Punk. I do want to see if I can make him come up here. I'm paranoid his archer buddy's gonna make like difficult for me. There we go. Ugh. I don't know why I was having such a hard time with that earlier. I think I'm just relying too much on the lucerne. If I was having better luck with the mace. Since that's more in people's faces. Oh. I'm out of juice. Yeah, this is probably the last time I've used to kill him. Alright. Well, I wonder how much luck we'll have running up there. As soon as we get to a point where we're not worried about souls, I'm actually going to see if I can find the best uh, small shield that so I think those give you more pairing frames to work with. Let's see if these guys are as big parry bait as they were in Dark Souls 1. I still have no idea if you can sprint up ladders or not. It's a That's it, I'm looking that up. Sprint ladders. Inform me, internets. I 
You know, let's try this. I feel like we can at least run up and down without getting shot off the edge. See if maybe we can get one of them to fall off. And now. I'll scratch that idea. Probably not gonna be running these guys. And I'm not liking this. I'm just checking up. Message here, making sure it's not important. Okay. Well, it looks like mine now is part of it. Ah, shucks. Watch for the thrust. Ah, sometimes they drop large Titanite shard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can, much I can ignore him. Remember, is there another sword and shield guy up here, or just another? Frame too late on the backstab there. Well, I'm surprised at my luck. Apparently, that guy's sole purpose in life are those two pathways, and then once you're up, he's done. Let's go ahead and leave a message about that, actually. I'm keeping one of these dudes. You need to rethink your life. <laughs> 